old man. Slow the hell down. Damn, kid. Shut up. So, this is legit? She's definitely not human. We can't be sure, but there's an excellent chance she's the real Valentine. If we can believe her declaration of war, then no part of the world is safe. Uh, that's just great. So, what's she worth? Excuse me? Bounty hunter, remember? I only work when there's money on the table. <sighs> Very well. There is something I need to discuss with you. Bring Sin. You know where to find me. Just name your price. A million world dollars. A million? In cash. <sighs> Damn, old man. No mercy. <laughs> Doesn't pay. A single girl has declared war on the entire world. Apparently, our intel was correct. Unfortunately, this makes the Opus's activation even more worrying. It is entirely possible our own government can no longer be trusted. We must operate on our own from now on. I shall accompany you. I thank you. It seems as though the Crusade only just ended. People want answers. I can scarcely blame them after all the things that they've seen. First we retrieve Seoul, then to Japan. Should we prepare payment in advance as usual? No doubt he'll demand it. 300,000 world dollars should be sufficient. or if it's just itchy or dirty or something. May, was Ramuthel telling the truth or not? Huh? Hmm. I don't know. Uh, I should have known. But we do know that Ramuthel is out there scaring people, right? That means we gotta go beat her up. Whoa, whoa, hold on. She just declared war on the whole entire world. Aren't you scared? Smile in the face of danger is the jellyfish pirate motto, right? If Johnny were here, I know that's what he'd say. Yeah, you're right. East it is then. All right, and away we go! Are you? My presence here should serve as assurance that this is genuine. Good to see you too, Venom. The Conclave has been using him to control us for far too long. It has to stop. Zato's return means the return of the Guild, the real Guild. You can't afford to ignore this opportunity. You seem rather calm. I know you've left, but this information concerns you as well. Don't be so sure, but I do understand why you decided to share this with me. All we need now is a location. One more thing though, you do understand that we're being watched. Of course I do. I realize that means if we should meet on the battlefield, then, then we, we fight. fight. Consent. Rebellion. Overkill. Legs. Hey! We don't go outside, leave this world of shadows? Drill. <sighs> Renaissance. Still not up to having a real conversation, are we? You do realize we're the first creatures in history to come back from the dead. We need to be cool. Infinite possibilities become void as a result of infinite experience. That concept is pointless. Words are only a prison, from which we derive our own unique false meaning. Reality. Reality is only a white sheet painted black. Here, outside, it makes no difference. Rainbow. Good grief. Rage. Deep purple. Human chair. Heaven's gate. Melia. Melia. She... she's close. I can feel her. Perhaps 
the outside is not so bad. Internal energy levels from the gravitational disturbance have reached 334 Zs. Its interference margin with the Earth's axis is 0.8H. Maximum physical compensation we've detected is 4506 FRZs. I am now certain. This Ramlethal creature cannot possibly be human. Direct confrontation on our own would be foolish. We must secure UN support. Hmm. They've requested our scientific insight already. They will have it. Before we have used science, not diplomacy. Our technology is more advanced than that of other nations. However, this time I feel we must work together. We do not, however, understand why Ramlethal hasn't left Japan, which is worrying. It must have a role to play in their planned calamity. We've offered our full cooperation to the UN in preparation for the worst case scenario. Potemkin, I want you to scout the area and find out what you can. Understood. Mr. President. Hey, hey boss, wait! I mean, please, wait. I'm not boss anymore. I'm president. Well, yes, of course, but we still haven't been formally recognized by other nations. Besides, isn't it a little weird to call it the Eastern Ship Kingdom if you're a president? It just sounds better. Don't sweat the details, man. Moving on. The world has been terrified ever since Ramlothal made her declaration. So please don't run off. You're thinking too small. A hero who saves the whole world can found his own country, right? I don't think it's quite that simple. But sometimes I think we are as happy as we are because our boss is that simple. Res a dent. <laughs> Take care of the place while I'm gone. Hmm. I see. I see. Of course. Oh, every man needs a best friend. Finally, I can uncover the truth behind my greatest failure. A long and windy road it was, but perhaps my days as a back alley doctor are through. Of course, the sins I've committed since then can hardly be wiped away, but I suppose I do owe the vampiric gentleman a complimentary dental checkup or two. Could you show me the way? Ah, damn it. This future again. Uh, not that I've ever been able to pick where I go, but why do I have to keep ending up here? Whoa! What the... Axel Lowe. Who's there? Who are you? The first person to set foot in this realm. The original. If the Time Traveler wishes to progress further, he must deliver a message. A message for that man, the Gear Maker. <laughs> the hell was that? Who's that voice? The Gear Maker, huh? Damn. Well, that's just great. How do I find him? This is the first time you've contacted us directly. If you're trying to circumvent the post-war administration bureau, you may want to rethink your actions. What? I do not understand your motives. If you think you pull my strings, the Assassin's Guild strings, then you're gravely mistaken. My apologies, please forgive me. First, however, I must verify your information myself. You claim Zato, our late leader, has been brought back to life. Fine, but I need proof. This means we'll likely need Melia in the shadows.
Hmm. Did something happen? I received a message from a friend with whom I thought I had lost contact. Zato is among the living, it seems. Zato? He is alive? He is alive now might be a more accurate way of putting it. That's impossible, at least without resurrection. Yes, a phenomenon the world has yet to see, even among my own illustrious vampiric brethren. This could mean a new dawn for mankind, or a new nightfall. Sharon, would you care to take a stroll? I've a great many questions that need answers. Of course. I'll always be at your side. It's almost here. Again. No matter how many times I killed Ramlethal, history never changed. But that man has been led into this cycle. Something has to change in that dull gray world. The first thing I'll do is rip off souls. I've actually known for a long time that you worked for the vampire. Are you curious? Would you like to know why I didn't do anything? Don't take this the wrong way, but you simply weren't an obstacle. Additionally, you played a very important role, delivering information, or misinformation. Did you think you were succeeding in your infiltration? Oh, sorry to burst your bubble, but you only got exactly as far as I wanted you to. Did I hurt your feelings? But you've been getting a little too close, so I've been put into play. You weren't an obstacle. You were an extra, and you're trying to hog the spotlight. And that is something of a no-no. You play your role, you don't take someone else's, don't you agree? Are you scared? Unfortunate, yes. This must seem unjust, unfair, unfathomable. You're probably filled with unease and unhappiness. Sorry, but I need you to give up. Goodbye. Me? Just a bed of no consequence made for removing obstacles. Ah! Oh, someone just died in the middle of the street! What happened to him? Oh god, his face. What did he see before he died? The people are disappearing! That energy. Don't tell me there's another Valentine out there. God damn it, old man! We've got to save them! No, they couldn't. Then, could she have been telling the truth? Kai, just what the hell do you know? Okay, that's enough. I'm completely expendable. I'm a pawn, you see. It's time we die. Let's go together. Get out of there now! Just getting ready to blow you up! Shit. All those people are disappearing! This energy. Is there another Valentine? Damn it! She's killing them! Can't you do something? That's not possible. And she was telling the truth about everything after all. Then I ask, what is the Conclave's response? No! They're disappearing! We have to help them! Too late. The process has already begun. Then stop it! I can't do that. What's done is done. We have served our purpose, Japanese girl. Now it is all over for us. Japanese? What does that even mean? Something that is at least somewhat valuable to us. But something that the rest of humanity considers a disease. What? I still don't understand. What was it that made the Conclave decide to revive you? They are not interested in the art of resurrection, per se. They do not care about the how. All that matters to them is now I am alive. You see? That is why I have become this dull and uninteresting soul. What do you mean? War is coming. 
The Conclave intends to start a war to remake the world. And it is about to begin. The Conclave's plan has already been set in motion. In truth, I fear I cannot face this one alone. I may have been reborn, but my sins are not, and never will be, cleansed. Amelia, I fear. I fear for the survival of humankind. Can either of us ever find the answers we seek? Humans disappearing? Impossible! What's causing this? Respond! Potemkin, come in! Mr. President, the situation's gotten worse. I'm calling you back. What about Bramlethal? I am only a pawn. I still can't believe how many of you fools fell into our trap. What? This is it. The end for all of humanity. You're finished. The moment you failed to prevent the activation of the Cradle, right then your fate was sealed. There must be something! Damn it! What the hell is going on here? Every single one of you is going to die a horrible death. It's all over now. As soon as the Cradle was activated, the future was set. There's nothing you can do to stop it. I have zero idea what you're saying, but I'm the one here who decides what happens and what doesn't. Don't you even know who I am? I'm the president! You see, you proposed an unauthorized procedure to save a young girl's life, but you were denied repeatedly. Resurrection. Your procedure held the secret. The secret of returning a once dead human body to life. I don't see what the problem was with that. The Conclave needed those secrets to remain secret, or their plans would be irreparably compromised. However, you chose to perform the procedure anyway in defiance of their orders. They asked me to see that you were taken care of. I myself only discovered the truth behind these lies very recently. Foolishness! Have they gone mad? Just what is the Conclave trying to accomplish with all of this? To start a war. A global conflict. A war to create a whole new world. Finally, the day is here. My chance to light up this dull future with amazing fireworks. Fireworks, huh? Uh, hey, a uh, bit late on this, but that man, he's the war criminal who kind of started the Crusades, isn't he? Does that mean I've just gotten myself into some really seriously deep trouble? Oh, don't worry. In fact, you might be our savior. Really? Well, I guess that's good. Oh, wait a sec. You called me this timeline. Does that... does that mean you can send people anywhere you want in time? Send me back! Please, send me back home! May 14th, 1998, 20th Century Cotswolds. My street, my home! I can send you back, but the future's anyone's guess. For now, I think you should probably go to the integration point. Huh? Uh, wait, what? The Conclave will use the Cradle. Their intent is to change the world. That is why they've allied with a monster. And why they want to understand the secrets that are hidden inside my body. Change? What is it they want? A great war. The Conclave's war. A war that will create a new world. The Holy Crusade only just ended. And already mankind faces extinction again? A new conflict. I can see it waiting over the horizon. Lord Sato, what did humanity do to earn this karma?
Have you learned why the Conclave would want you back among the living? Pleasant company excluded, of course. More or less. They revive me, yes, but... They never bothered to question or command me. I can draw only one conclusion. They were never interested in Zato One. Resurrection is the great key to immortality. Do you believe an end to death could be their ultimate goal? No. I do not. I believe they are concerned with the sacrilegious secrets inside my body. Sacrilegious? <clears throat> then you mean the art of resurrection? No, that can't possibly be true! I've gone through the integration point a thousand times and it's never changed at all. Until now, it was always the same. Yes, I made the right choice bringing that man here. Now time might actually start to move a little in that awful future. Maybe. I'll be able to keep my train of thought going past this damn station. Oh, wouldn't that be nice? Hmm? Someone's caught in my net? <laughs> oh, man, you've got to be kidding me again! For the lover, still you saved me. Thank you, god or gods, or whatever you are. Uh -huh. Huh? Wait, you're a... Uh... It's very flattering of you to call me a god. You're welcome, my child. <laughs> I called you to this timeline. Good. The story is finally moving forward. This planet's history is about to change dramatically, perhaps as much as it did on the day it was created. The crusade and that silly resurrection will only be a tiny blip on the radar. All boundaries will be abandoned, all shortcomings mended, and all fiction remedied. Incompetence will be met with standards, cheaters will be oppressed by freedom, and the discontent will be trampled upon. The irrational and temporizing behavior that has destroyed our world will be consigned to history and the world of absolution will begin. The only remaining problem is that man. He may not have appeared on stage, but he knows the cast, crew, and lines far too well. If he decides to interrupt our plans, it could undo the work we've done. Which is why I fervently hope the Conclave's plans continue unimpeded, at least for now. Whoops. Almost time for me to go. My client doesn't like agents who can't deliver. A house cat only knows the world its master lets it know. Its freedom has been taken away. So should that cat be dissatisfied to know only a fraction of the world? A stray cat, however, may have to fight for survival every day of its life, an exhausting battle, but every possibility is open to the stray. The definition of happiness, of course, varies from person to person, but what this world lacks is awareness. Well then, wouldn't you agree with that assessment? Out of my way, kid. You're not going anywhere alone. Wait for reinforcements. Heh. <laughs> Why? If I blow it, we're all royally screwed anyway. That is exactly why. You gotta be kidding me! We must wait, watch, and act only when the time is right. Heh. <laughs> That's it, huh? I don't need to know what that thing is to kill it. Look, I'm a bounty hunter. That means I go where the bounties are. We're done here. Violence, then. It's the only language that you understand, right? I'm a native speaker. Hope you ain't gone soft. Not bad.
That sure took you long enough. Heaven or hell? Let's rock! A world separate from our own, yet somehow controlling it. The backyard, hidden behind its gates, are the eternal truths of good and of evil, of creation and of destruction, of chaos the likes of which mankind has never seen. In a time long past, a philosopher entered this other realm. He returned, and through shuddering breaths, he spoke. No evil should touch this place. This philosopher sealed all that the backyard was into a single tome. His hope was that mankind would never stumble upon its power. With that, the path to the backyard was forever barred, and peace once again blessed our world. But what followed, the ancient sage could never have predicted. For evil came not from a human who discovered the book, but from inside the backyard itself. My name is Ramlethal Valentine. I declare war on all the world. All those unworthy to stand upon it will be destroyed. The future is the past.
我々の身は枝についたままとっくに腐ってしまっていたのだ種を落とすこともなくバビロンで何かが起こったそっちと関係があるラムレザルを捕獲するそのためには彼女の力が必要だ私たち姉妹はお互いに同等の欲試験を持っています止めてみせます間もなく我々の新たな世界が入るそうそして物語は思惑通りに運んでいるお前は本当にあの男に復讐を果たすためだけに私たちと行動を共にしているのかいいか俺は化け物だ全てのギアとあの男を駆逐するためだけに生きている作り物とか俺らと違うってことが何か悪いのかわからないどうして母さんは彼女を作ったのリラシオフレデリックがバックヤードに飲み込まれるぞ この事件は彼の侵略戦争ではないかもしれない。どうして彼女たちに感情なんか与えたんだ。私はない。100%の国家では満足できない。あの強烈な攻撃が来る可能性が高い。すぐにその場を離れろ。貴様たちの要求はこ
Let's go now. 